Oh my god, I'm blinded. This sun might kill this video a bit, but let's just grow with it. Yes, folks, it's been a minute, hasn't it? I'm just trying to think what the last video was. Was it Havana? Mm, I don't think I managed to do a video. Lots and lots of reasons why, but we'll, uh, we might get into that. Anyway, welcome back to me, Danny. And zero, zero. This, like, I think is going to kill this video, but uh, we're just going to go with it. No guests today. Uh, a couple of reasons why. One, it's UK lockdown, uh, for anyone who isn't aware. Two, I have been tracked and traced oh my god in fact i'm gonna close the curtains give me a second oh is that better oh now we can see now we can see that's that's a lot better shall i start this video again nah let's not bother so yeah i got tracked and traced so i had an app that stupid app on my phone i used it once to check in at pizza express on my birthday like a month ago didn't even realise it on my phone, and then I was just flicking on my phone, got no, not a notification, I was even just flicking through, looking at the apps, deleting some apps, you know, tiny on your phone like you do at a bit of time. Clicked into the app and it said you need to isolate. So I'm on day three of ten isolation days, but it is what it is, what can we do? Anyway, less about that, more into trainers. Here is what we have got today. Oh. Purple box, you know what it is. You know what it is. There we go. We've got some Nike Speed Dunk Low Pros. Medium grey, clear jade black. We've seen that colourway before. So let's, and not a quick strike, these are just a GR box. Now, GRs are just as hard to get in Dunk SPs at the minute as, uh, as quick strikes, so don't take anything from it, but here we go. Pop it there. Alright. Check these bad boys out. Oh my. Right, so. What to say about these? Oh my goodness. Right. I first heard about these, I got a little bit of inside info and it was probably, it was either this time last year or the start of 2020 that an Atmos Elephant Dunk SB is coming out and I was like, my mind just absolutely blew. I was like, there is no no way, they are not doing Atmos Elephant Dunk and they're like, yeah, there's one coming out and I'm like, oh my god, 100%, 100% I am getting this. I've been waiting since however long it was and they finally dropped so I picked up mine from the good guys at Welcome, thank you very much Welcome, uh, you know, there's a, there's a few places I get my skate, uh, my Dunk SBs from but Welcome, Attitude are the main places as well as the other ones like No and I've got some from a board, I can't remember which one it is, Skate Deluxe as well, that's, that's the other one I use a bit but yeah, the good guys at Welcome came through with the, uh, with the win on these. Now couple of things, my Air Max, and I'm going to get my Air Max ones as well, I brought them down. So if you don't know, these, uh, my Air Max, Atmos Air Max ones are one of my favourite shoes, if not my favourite pair in the collection actually. People are always ask me, what is your favourite pair Danny? The reason these were, I didn't get the 2007 ones, I was not in the game, or I was really, really skint and I couldn't get them. So when they were released in 2017, I had to get a pair, uh, and I obviously did get a pair. Um, and the colourway is just so iconic. I, I, I absolutely love the colourway on the Airbox one. On the Dunk, what we're seeing, I've, I've put a little post out on Instagram, I've not checked it, can't be bothered, to see if the colourway works better on a Dunk than it does. On the Air Max. Let me know in the comments what you think. Personally, I think the Air Max colourway works ever so slightly better uh, than the Dunk. For the pictures, I was almost disappointed when I saw it. I thought it was actually a bit weak, but in hand, they're actually quite good. And on foot, I've done some on feet, and I'll put some pictures on on the Instagram for you to look at. But look at the details. So we get what you don't get actually is 
on the Air Max, you get like a, a it has like a sheen to the uh, to the midsole. I wish it'd have had that sheen on the midsole. Let's discuss. Let's discuss the big talking point, the elephant print. Uh, I know I've seen people with dodgy toe boxes as well. Mine are all good. The toe boxes. The quality on these are actually not too bad. The elephant prints a bit. I'm gonna quote Stevie Insta G. If you don't follow Stevie, make sure you give him a follow. Uh, it's a bit wavy, he said, and I was like, I can't agree more. But as we go around, as we go around, look. Oh no. Look, I've just got a little patch on my pair, which is a bit shonky. Just around here. I mean, the rest of it's not amazing. Just a bit shonky on that pair. But you get the uh, clear jade. Nike, and obviously the swoosh. And I think, I think the swooshes are ever so slightly different colours as well. Can you see that? Ever so slightly different. Now, I don't know if that's an age thing or what, but slightly different colour. You get the Nike SB Dunk Low Pro Tongue, uh, and you just get, again, a little bit disappointed. You just get a black insole. So, on the Air Maxes, you're going to have to afford, um, excuse the sock fluff. You get the Atmos. Oh, I can't read which way around it is. It's that way, isn't it? Uh, you get the Atmos uh, collab on there. So these are not these are not an Atmos collab. I know people will call them the Atmos Elephant Dunks. They are not uh, they are not an Atmos collab though. Uh, and I just want to show you my other side because my left foot, believe it or not, look, this is how they should be looking. I think because my left foot, I think, okay, maybe at the front it looks a bit rubbish, but the print looks a little bit better. There's no quality issues on this side. Uh, and I've seen some really, really shonky ones. Chelsea from Sneaker Illuminati. Oh man, her pair, her pair had a piece of actual print missing. Uh, and you do get some grey laces in as well. I've snapped mine off already because I've, uh, I've worn these for a picture. Grey laces. Mm. I did think I was going to pop some white laces in. And I saw a picture with white laces. If I find it, I'll drop it in a video. But I don't know if I find it. And I won't feel in the white laces. I usually match... My lace is to my midsole, but I don't think it works on these. I think the black ones, just like, again, like the Air Max, uh, I think the black works. So here's the thing. We've had a couple of Air Max inspired. Oh, we've had a few, haven't we? Uh, I think I still will go with that the, uh, that the Air Max 1 is better than the Dunk on the Atmos Elephant colourway. However, I did bring another pair down, so let me just grab this. Now, I wear this pair quite a lot, so you will have seen them quite a lot on Instagram or around and about. And they are the safaris, so they're probably going to look a bit battered, maybe. Uh, not too bad. Um, I did wear them the other day. Now, the safari dunk, again, these were an orange label, so not a GR. Uh, these were an orange label. I'm going to put it out there that... The Safari Dunk is better than the Safari Air Max. I genuinely think it. I don't have a Safari Air Max to compare, to be honest. Whereas I think the Air Max is better in the Elephant. L let me know down below what you think. And then out of the two, what we're saying, what we're saying out of these two iconic Air Max colourways on Dunks, I think I really like them. I, and I think they're better in hand. I was worried that I wouldn't like them in hand. But I think the Safari dunk is just slightly better than the Atmos Elephant Dunks. What we're saying, let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, great pickup, and I'm so stoked to get them. Like I said, the, 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 this little bit of quality issue is a bit shonky, but I, get, I was talking to my mate Dan Squire, which I probably would have done a video with him, apart from I'm in lockdown, and it is lockdown, and I'm in isolation, sorry. But it is what it is. Uh, shout out to everyone who keeps asking for Dan on the videos again. I think we have some great banter, me and Dan. So Dan will definitely be featuring on more videos going forward. Um, but yeah, I think that's it. Uh, what else to say? Oh, that's a nice little pop. I haven't seen that before. I think that's it. Great pickup. They'll be warm. And that's what we said. Even with the quality control issues, it don't really matter. They're not for sure that to wear out. You know I wear all my trainers. My Chunky Dunkies get worn. My Travis Scotts get worn. Everything that's like hyped and expensive, everything gets worn. So... It is what it is. 
Right, I think that's it for today. Uh, there's more videos to come. I've got a giveaway video in the next one. In fact, I've got another couple. I've got a few giveaways coming up. I've got the close friends of Instagram video. I'm waiting for those trainers from October to be delivered. I got a notification saying that they are on the way. Uh, I've drawn the November one as well. So I'm going to get some trainers for maybe in a week's time for the November giveaway. And I will try and put as much content out as possible. Don't forget, check out the Instagram, so the Sneaker Addicts on Instagram. Check out the Royce Dino Instagram, because I'll be doing loads over the next week or so while I'm just sat at home twiddling my thumbs. Uh, I think that's it for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, blah, blah, blah. See you next time, Alex. Bye.